You are now watching Tales from the Grid. Happy Power Week, Happy everyone! Power Week. We're super excited to be here. Now available on HasbroPulse.com is going to be our Dino Thunder yellow figure. So we just wanted to show that to you. Jordan, do you want to tell us a little bit about it? I'll take it away. Check out Dino Thunder Yellow, aka Kira, and all her Dino Thundery uh, glory. So, uh, as you can see from this package, she comes with uh, the classic civilian portrait looking very early 2000s. She also includes the Terra Grip twin uh, dagger thing she has and the Thunder Max Blaster, as well as a blast effect for the bla uh, right there, uh, blast effect for that blaster, which you can see as I just give you guys a little pan around the package. We just announced Ryu. Tell us more about the yeah, figure, Jordan. Yeah, let's take a quick close look. Ryu in all of his morphed Crimson Hawk Ranger glory, has amazing articulation, uh, comes with two different hand options, open and close, as well as these three awesome video game inspired effect parts that you can use in a couple different ways. But one of the coolest ways is with this new stand that has a removable arm that you can mount the blast effects to. My favorite character from Street Fighter, and that is Chung Lee. I am super excited about her figure. I love the way that these came out in design. She looks absolutely incredible. Yeah, the team did a great job bringing the the blazing Phoenix Ranger to life. Uh, just like with Ryu, who we revealed yesterday, uh, Chun-Li includes two different sets of hands, fists and open palm, um, three video game inspired effect pieces, and a display stand with removable peg uh, for blast effects. <clears throat> so they can duke it out. <sighs> In celebration of I Love Power Rangers, we announced um, Wild Force Blue Max. So, we just wanted to have a closer look of the product. And Check here you go, Jordan. Out. So, Wild well, Force Blue Max, I think this is actually the first look that we are seeing on his amazing portrait. Big shout out to Corey and Loretta and the rest of the team for putting together an, another awesome addition to the Wild Force team. You can see he comes with both of his, what are his Tonfa weapons called again? His shark Fighting. fin. And we're actually going to be showing you a first look of the Paint Master of Coda. Check him out in all his dino charging glory. We're going to be coming out with Beast Morpher's Yellow Ranger, Zoe. We're super excited about that and these will be both pre-ordered. But first off, we have MMPR Snizzard. A brand new monster to the line. Uh, fun fact, originally voiced by Brian Cranston himself. Now, wow, really? Yes, moved on to very, very amazing things since then. But um, I'm sure we like to think of Power Rangers as giving him a, a great start in, in the voice acting field. Um, but onto the figure itself. In addition to Snizzard, we have Time Force Blue. Time Force with his vector cycle. Uh, I'm a pretty big fan of the general aesthetic of Time Force. Uh, I think that working in the clock motif across pretty much every aspect of design is like, is always just like, oh, you love to see it. A plus, amazing job, Sentai design team. And I think the team here, it was super, super excited to bring some true vehicles to the Lightning Collection Deluxe line. Today, we are actually going to be announcing the MMPR Yellow Ranger Morpher. Yeah, this is so exciting. Jordan, tell us more. So it's a continuation of the movie style Morpher line. I believe it was last year that we had um, MMPR Pink. This time around for GameStop, we're having MMPR Yellow. Dino Fury, we're really excited about our announcement on Monday that the second half of the season is going to be available on Netflix later this fall. So we actually have a sneak peek of a minute clip of episode 14 just for you. So this is Rafcon. It certainly smells alien. They are both electronic and both powered up. Thank you, thank you. So you can live out your Yellow Ranger dreams with the power of daggers. But um we are a toy company and so we do like to have some really cool toyetic features when we can uh so 
in the show, the power daggers don't combine like this, but in the toy, we thought it would be a really cool uh, feature to incorporate. I will be returning to Power Rangers season 30, which is viewable in 2023. And the name of the season is Power Rangers Cosmic Fury. Now, as you can see, the sets are going up here in the studio in New Zealand, and we have a little tease that we wanted to share with you. So let's take a look. Thank you everyone for joining us. That concludes everything that we have what for a week. Power Week. <laughs>